Our team is Tiny Trach. We're making a, a camera-aided endotracheal tube. We have an interdisciplinary group of mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, and then most of us are bioengineers. So we make up a group of seven, and we all bring our different skills to try and make the tube work. Our sponsor from Texas Children's Hospital came with us with the problem that um, in the intubated babies he's seen, being the ones that are on breath support in the hospital, a lot of them have to get their breathing tubes checked with x-rays, and that's really dangerous and really expensive for the parents. Um, and so he wanted to find a way to be able to check that breathing tubes were in the correct place in the baby's airway without having to like basically sting them with x-rays and without having to just jostle them around that much. So our project is basically wanting to add a camera onto the tube, the end of the tube, so that the physician can locate the right position of the tube inside the airway. So this is our intubation baby model. This is our anchoring mechanism that holds the tube in place after it's intubated. This is our integrated uh, camera model with the tube. There's an LED inside, a camera, and a flush port to clear off the camera lens when it gets dirty. So essentially while the physician is intubating, they'll have a clear view of the trachea and the tracheal anatomy until they get to a point called the carina where they can stop. So getting all the components super small and in the right place uh, was one of our biggest innovations here. So we just went to Texas Children's Hospital and we had Dr. Jane test it. And the points I think that he was most impressed by were the fact that this camera is so small. This camera is one millimeter by one millimeter by one millimeter in cross section, which is about as small as you can get. And the fact that this um, light is not getting too hot in the body, because that's also a concern that we had, and that this tube is like durable and flexible and the fact that we're able to combine all of this and not only solve the problem about like intubating in the right spot, but also the securing mechanism. The fact that we've got better attachment, better visualization, and it's an overall like cohesive package that we're producing makes it a great project. 